Hey everybody, so this is going to be a really quick video to show you how to cheat and get slightly longer laces in your corset without having to completely relace it and buy new laces. This will not apply to, for instance, like 80% of people I know, but for those of you who are uh, extreme tight lacers or you're a little bit more compressible, a little bit extra fluffy, and you're able to achieve um, eight introductions very easily, or even more possibly, then this is for you. So um, in some corsets, you might notice that uh, the, the laces don't come with quite enough slack to get the corset on and off easily. And we don't want you to be stressing out the busk and twisting and, and warping it in any way because that could risk breaking off one of the knobs or the pins of the busk. So in this corset, uh, with the laces extended as far as it'll go, it can open nine and a half inches. So I would say that would be enough for somebody um, wearing a corset with like an eight introduction or maybe seven and a half introduction. Normally my formula is um, whatever amount of reduction you're looking for, uh, add another two inches on to that and that's how much slack you should have for your corset to be able to get it on and off easily. So what you're gonna do, it's super easy, you just take this knot at the bottom and you undo it. And then you unthread just the very bottom set of grommets. Normally, this will not significantly affect the fit of the corset because the very bottom edge of the corset um, normally doesn't put any pressure on your hips it should kind of lay smoothly along your hips and gently cradle and cup your hips but not like squeeze it to oblivion so most people are not going to miss one grommet and you're still going to have the tension and the support from one more inch up so once you unthread it from these bottom grommets what you're just going to do is retie it in a knot and what that's going to do is give you Another, if this was nine and a half inches, it's going to give you another uh, nine and a half times two is 19 inches of extra slack in your laces. And so because this lacing is no longer doubled over in the corset like that, it gives you this much extra slack. So now you can just redistribute it. Now you can choose whether you want to um, take this from the bottom like I did here that's the easiest way to do it it's the fastest way or you can take it from the top if you don't need any um, support right here at the underbust area or the upper back um, but that will obviously take a lot longer because you have to basically unlace and relace the entire corset so I basically put the slack in the bunny ears and then redistribute it equally above and below the waist So this looks fairly uh, equidistant and parallel here. So let's see. Now we have a 10 and a half inch lacing gap in the back right at the waistline. So we've given ourselves one more inch of extra slack. So if you just need that one tiny little bit to get the corset to wrap around yourself, this is the fastest and easiest way to do it. You don't have to spend five to $10 to buy a new pair of laces. Um, of course, if you want to replace your laces, you absolutely can. But for those of you who live in places where you can't go out and uh, buy laces in a shop or the uh, shipping prices are prohibitive to allow you to buy laces online or any other reason that you sort of you, you can't get your hands on extra laces, this is the fastest and easiest way to do it. So I wouldn't exactly call it a hack. Like it's it's very simple. It's very intuitive to do. Um, but it will give you that small little extra bit that maybe you might not have considered to do in the past. So I hope this was helpful to some of you and I will see you next week for another review.